Hello friends uh, and welcome back to the complete course of uh, jQuery. Uh, in this class, uh, we are going to discuss again about function, a uh, very important function. This is called jQuery width and height function. So this is the basic syntax you can see, which I have inserted inside the script tag, and here inside the body, we are going to insert a center tag. Center tag start and center take close inside this we are going to create a div div star and div close you need uh, you need to just create a id here or a class any of them it's optional you can use uh, i'm just creating class and equal sign double quotation inside this uh, i'm just giving a name for this for example di double v1 this is the name so just come inside the CSS, put a dot for class, div1 is the name, and open a curly braces. So you must declare here a width and height, for example, 300 pixels should be the width, and the height should be 300 pixels. Uh, background color, you can give any color you want, so I'm just giving a green color for this. Text color, uh, white i'm just giving a white color font size font size something like uh, you can say 35 pixel you can save this uh, just launch in chrome to see the result uh, you can see we have a box which is located in the center of the web page and 300 by 300 pixel width and height now we are going to use here uh, we are going to learn how we can change width and height inside the jquery so at first you need to insert a dollar sign and very easy round bracket a dot the round bracket and semicolon here inside the first uh, parentheses or round bracket you can say you can insert single quotation you can select the class dot di double v1 and here you can use the height for example the height or width you can use directly here width you can give any width for example for right now the width of this element is 300 pixels you can see you can define a new width here for example 500 i'm just giving the width Control s to save now come here and refresh so you can see we have changed the width you can give any width 500 800 100 Control s and refresh now it's 800 pixel width so the same way if you want to give uh, height so i'm just using 500 pixel width after this round bracket you can put a dot and you can mention here the height property height and another round bracket so you can say just 500 by 500 should be width and height Control s and refresh you can see 500 by 500 and uh, so you can just uh, define width and height in one line also and if you don't want like this so you can just remove this you can make this duplicate by pressing ctrl plus d here and this is width and this one is height h e i g h t height you can give any height for example say 100 pixel height control s and refresh so you can see the width is 500 the height is say 100 pixel or you can give the hit the uh, height 200 pixel the width just you can say say 100 pixel so it is optional you can give any width any height you can see we can uh, just uh, we can change like this the width and height inside the jquery so there is one more way to just uh, you can get information about uh, the width for example you have uh, given the width here and the width is 300 pixel and the height is also 300 pixel if you want to get uh, some information about this uh, element width and height so i'm just going to create a variable here for example variable so this width i'm just writing here width underscore v is equal to this and you can remove this from here uh, we don't need this anymore 
press ctrl d to duplicate this and this one is height and here also you need to write height so we have created variable width variable height underscore v variable width underscore v so just come down here and insert the dollar sign a round bracket full stop another round bracket and semicolon inside this uh, single quotation sorry we are going to just call dot tiwv1 and here we are using text if you want to write any text for example uh, i'm just saying here the width is the width is uh, you can just give a space here and plus after seeing a single quotation you are going to use a plus and width underscore v you can save this come here and refresh so you can see the width is 300 pixel it's just giving you the information and if you want to just uh, the width is 300 pixel you want to just write here so you can just uh, put a plus after this v and insert single quotation inside the single quotation you are going to give px it means pixel refresh the width is 300 pixel so the same way you can just write here and uh, the height the height is uh, you can put a plus here outside this uh, single quotation so you can use height underscore v and another plus single quotation for px control s to save now just come here and refresh so you can see the width is 300 pixel and height is 300 pixel so you can just get uh, information like this again information about width and height or you can say element so you can give any width any height for example we are going to change the width to 600 pixel and the height to 400 control s let's check refresh now you can see the width is 600 pixel and the height is 400 pixel so any give uh, any width any height you are going to define it will give the correct information for example 1000 pixel width by 500 uh, height control s and refresh so you can see the width is 1000 pixel and the height is 500 pixel so this is the way of uh, how we can just change uh, the width of any element inside the jquery and how we can just get information about uh, width and height so as we are just uh, getting here the width and height information so for that you need to create a variable and you need to just call the variable here uh, with that text event you can see so i hope uh, this will be helpful for you this clear for you and uh, just watch the videos and do practice have a nice time and see you